A first surprise for many visitors to Trump Tower, its legendary lobby is open to the public. Tourists taking snapshots of the same gilded escalator Donald Trump rode down to announce his candidacy. An even bigger attraction, the elevator, also gilded, which goes to the office of the next president of the United States. Since the election, this elevator has carried every one of Trump's visitors, a cavalcade of cabinet hopefuls, stars, and billionaires, all before the watchful eye of the TV cameras that have been camped out here for over a month. I have to wait for the light to come, and then uh, whatever light, I zoom into that elevator, and I... So you always have to have your eye open over here. It's politics, tourism, and shopping all mixed together. What happens upstairs is a bit more private. Up to the 26th floor, the tower is office space, including for Trump himself. <laughs> Further up, 265 luxury apartments. Actor Bruce Willis and footballer Cristiano Ronaldo keep pied-a-terres there. Even Michael Jackson had a residence. At the very top, the inner sanctum, Donald Trump's three-story penthouse. Well, welcome to Trump Tower. George Lombardi is an Italian businessman and Trump's neighbor. He's proud to live in the same building as the future president, whom he's known for over 20 years. We both have a bit of a taste for the Rococo, the Baroque, but Trump's style is a bit more, let's say, American. That flashy style is reflected throughout the building. Some gold everywhere. To try to sell vacant apartments, this real estate agent has had to change the decor. Everybody prefers modern, clean, uh, simple, minimalistic. The list price, 2 million euros for 100 square meters. But for now, no buyers. Trump Tower seems to have lost some of its residential appeal. That may have something to do with the massive security cordon that now surrounds the area. Luxury boutiques in and around the tower are losing clients, with some itching to move out, since the nuisance won't be letting up anytime soon. That's because even after he moves to the White House, Donald Trump plans to spend his weekends here.